Hey, do you want to learn how to make a cinematic photo slideshow in minutes in Filmora just like the one you're watching right now? Then stay with me, I'll show you how. Before we get started, if you're new here, hit the subscribe button for more awesome videos like this. So let's get started. Let's start by importing our images. I've done that already. You can import yours. Drag your images to track one on the timeline, one after the other. Or you can highlight them and drag them down at once. Click on the image and go to crop and zoom. Change the ratio to 69 and go to palm and zoom and add zoom to your image. Click on the second image and go to crop and zoom. Change the ratio to 69 and click on pan and zoom and apply zoom to your image. Follow the same process and do the same to all the other images. Go back to crop and zoom under pan and zoom and swap the start and end area by clicking on this icon. Do the same to all your images. Go to effects and set for bucket and 10 and drag it to track 2 on the timeline and expand it. Go back to effects and search for cinematic flares 2. Drag it down to track 3 on the timeline and expand it. Go back to effects again and search for light leak 4. Drag it down to track 4 on the timeline and expand it also. Now drag down the same images on track 1 to track 5 on the timeline. Go to effects, search for border, drag and drop it on your image. Then double click on the image and go to border under video effects. Change the start color to purple and end color to yellow. Also change the size and blow to 5 and click OK. Right click on your first image and copy effects and paste it on the rest of the images one after the other. Next double click on the first image and go to motion. Double click on flip down one to apply the effect to your image. Double click on your next image and go to motion and double click on flip down to to apply the effects to your image. 
follow the same process and do the same to all your other images, one after the other. Next, go to Transition and click on 3D and drag up and add it to the beginning of all your images, one after the other. Click on Render Preview for Smooth Playback. Let's click on play to preview our progress so far. Isn't it amazing? Alright, let's wrap this up by adding sound effects to the audio track below all our images at the beginning. Finally, we can add background music to it. Just drag and drop any music of your choice to the audio track on the timeline and make some necessary adjustments to it. When you're done, preview your project and make sure everything is perfect. Then click on export and have your final product. Well, talking about final product, here is our final product. Check it out. Isn't it awesome? Thank you for following through. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends so I can keep making them. For more videos like this, hit the subscribe button and remember to click on the notification bell. Also be sure to check out my other videos on this channel as well. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.